According to reports, Marvel Studios has figured out what to do with at least one person from the Eternals. And that's the Black Knight, Dane Whitman. As apparently, Jon Snow himself is going to be finding his way into Moon Knight Season 2. Get excited, all 17 people that enjoy the Eternals. Stay strong, boys. Stay strong, because they're returning. Well... He wasn't an Eternal, so maybe that disqualifies that. But hey, take the wins when you can, Eternals fans. Take them when you can. So yeah, brand new reports have suggested that when we get Moon Knight Season 2 in front of our very own eyes in a couple of years, Moon Knight will be joined by the Black Knight. Now, we don't exactly know what the story here is going to be, why, what direction they're going in, or anything like that. But from what I can see, and just from what insiders are saying... Moon Knight Season 2 will definitely be picking up the plot thread and what they did with Season 1. But also, since its setting is in a close proximity to Dane, which it is, they're literally like, what, neighbors close to, if not in the same city? Like, yeah, that makes sense. And also, it's a good way to establish more of the Midnight Suns, the darker side of Marvel you know, introducing Dane and the Blade. Maybe you toss him in doing some research in regards to it, leads him to a museum. Hey, he just so happens to bump into a version of one of the personalities. Maybe he's had dealings with one of them when we didn't see it off screen. Like, there's a lot of ways you could really make this work and put an interesting angle and twists on it. Like, just imagine if, I don't know, maybe the third personality, maybe Jake, Maybe he's been friends with Dane this whole time. And suddenly there's going to be this revelation where like, wow, they really, really nailed that. Like, there's a lot of cool possibilities here that I think they could use and do something interesting with. And I could see why they would want him here. It makes sense to put him on a TV series to further build him up. So when the big moment comes where he's got to be with them all and showing up as Black Knight, we kind of have a little bit of back history and... uh friendship and association with some characters.